How are you guys doing today? It's Anthony Ganji. Welcome to another episode of On The Line. Guys, great question sent my way. They said, Ganji, why does admin sweat the small things? Now, specifically, the question was related to a response of an inmate overdose and was caught on video. We were able to save the inmate's life. But the officers that ran to the code were not wearing their mask. So when the video was reviewed by the higher level, the feedback back to staff was, hey guys, everything was good, but why weren't you wearing your mask? Now the person that relayed this issue in the live chat that I did the other day with William Young, he wanted to know, I don't get it, Gange. We did all this and all of a sudden admin comes back and is concerned about wearing the mask. Why do you think that is? So specifically related to this scenario, the first thing I said, well, is I could picture being an admin. At this time during COVID, you're being bombarded with families and, and the inmates through the grievance system saying, we're not doing enough. And I could picture admin getting so overwhelmed with these complaints that there's a trust level on the smallest of things, knowing that if we're in compliance with all the COVID protocols, that I know that my staff is definitely maintaining social distancing and they're wearing their mask. I say that when I'm being called, say that when they're writing their responses, and then you find out when you see this video, and again, I'm talking about this gentleman's experience, that they're not wearing the mask. A small thing at the surface, but not so small when it comes to the credibility of that person that's answering those phone calls or writing back on those IRFs, those grievance systems. So now when that video gets out to the public, there's gonna be somebody looking at that no matter how good we do, there's gonna be somebody looking at that one little inconsistency, hey, do you guys notice that the officers that responded weren't wearing their mask? Small thing, yes, but well, that's crazy because when I wrote to such and such, you know, they responded back that they do practice this. And now to see all these officers not wearing their mask. Small thing. But it's the small things that hold the highest level of credibility. Because remember, guys, if we can't trust you doing the smallest of things. There's no way we can trust you doing the biggest of things. So sometimes people may feel that admin's going after the smallest of things, but usually it's to establish the level of credibility that we need to maintain that level of trust. I mean, I'm not saying that admin has to micromanage every level of responsibility, because that's impossible. As you move up, your areas become bigger and bigger and bigger. You'd be spread too thin. Sometimes it's safe to assume that if I gave you an assignment, I don't have to walk you through every letter of the alphabet. But when there's just that one inconsistency and there's that small thing that just wasn't done the way it should be done or you gave that person a level of trust and they didn't do it how it was supposed to be done. Think about that, guys. Think about that on the smallest of levels. And then think about how that could be taken to the highest of levels. Credibility begins with the smallest of things. It shows us that you're competent. It shows us that you know what's expected of you. But more importantly, it shows that we can trust you. So you may be thinking it's just the smallest of things, but maybe as management, we're thinking of where can this go? How can this be seen? What's the ripple effect? As always, guys, the show is on the line. If you haven't, don't forget to subscribe. Check out Guardian RFID. They got great videos on here. Just a lot of good videos that are informative. And I'll see you next week.